feel this. I'm not going to turn it on. Is there rubber? No. Are you sure? Are you sure you want to do this? Good night. Good night. You're pretty boy. You know, there's this great... I'm going to talk for so no talking, okay? So be... There is this great story in the Old Testament. I bet you people know this story. Abraham was very old when he had a son that he waited on forever, forever. And then the Lord told him to take a knife, take that son up a mountain, and sacrifice him, right? Can you imagine what Abraham was thinking about killing his only son? And what Isaac was thinking, probably he was worried just like you are about this star right here. But you know why Abraham did it? He had faith in God. He thought that God would heal that boy or he would somehow cause a miracle. Now, back then God talked right to people. Now we have the Holy Spirit and God has never told me to stab anybody. So I'm on my own here with this sawing him in half. I'm not sure. I know this, that if I don't have this to do that sawing straight, I might cook, cut a bunch of crooked holes in your leg. I'm in a big crooked, so I'm going to have this thing to make it straight. So that way, you know, they can at least, you know, sew you up in one straight line. And uh, let me give you... Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's rest. Let's relax. This will be to soak up the blood. <laughs> okay. All right. And just lay back. Relax. That's good. You just put your hands down like that. There we go. You can grab the table if you want. Now, I can't believe it. Now, I'm not doing miracles. I'm just doing silly tricks. I'm not going to tell you I'm doing it, though. But I want to make you do one last chance. Are you sure you want to do this? Okay, it's very important that I get, make sure the uh, blade is tight because one time... I got stuck right in the middle of the kid's stomach, and that was a mess. Okay, here we go. You ready? 